from chemicals used in genocides and political assassinations to toxins produced by bacteria. Here are the five most dangerous chemicals in the world. Hit that subscribe button and let's get started. VX The VX nerve agent is a clear, amber-colored liquid that's odorless and tasteless. Just 10 milligrams of VX are lethal via skin contact. It was developed as a chemical weapon in the 1950s in the United Kingdom, and it is not found naturally in the environment. North Korea's Kim Jong-un's half-brother, Kim Jong-nam, was assassinated by two women who smeared VX on his face. It is classified as a weapon of mass destruction by the United Nations and is banned by the Chemical Weapons Convention. The symptoms of VX exposure include muscle twitching, convulsions, and respiratory distress. In high doses, it can lead to paralysis, respiratory failure, and death. VX can be ingested, inhaled, or absorbed through the skin, making it a particularly dangerous chemical. Possession and use of VX is illegal in most countries. Watch till the end for a bonus on the list, a chemical that's eight times stronger than VX. Resin Resin is naturally found in castor beans. It can be made into a powder, mist, or pellet, and can be dissolved in water or weak acid. As little as 0.5 milligrams can be lethal. Resin has been used for medicine experiments to kill cancer cells. It would take a deliberate act to use it to poison people and unintentional exposure is unlikely, except through the ingestion of castor beans. In the 1940s, the US military experimented with resin as a possible warfare agent, and in 1978, it was used to assassinate Georgi Markov, a Bulgarian journalist and writer. A man attacked Markov with an umbrella that had been rigged to inject a resin pellet under his skin. Resin works by entering the body's cells and inhibiting the production of essential proteins. Cells die without the proteins. Exposure can occur through inhalation, ingestion, or injection. Symptoms vary depending on the route of exposure and can range from respiratory distress to vomiting and organ failure. Death can occur within 36 to 72 hours. There is no antidote for resin, so upon exposure, the most important factor is getting it off or out of the body as fast as possible and giving medical care to minimize the symptoms. One of the most recent incidents with recent happened in 2020, when a woman was arrested after law enforcement intercepted a package addressed to then-President Donald Trump containing recent. Sarin Sarin is a man-made chemical warfare agent classified as a nerve agent which is a highly toxic and rapidly acting chemical similar to some kinds of pesticides, but a lot more potent. It was developed in Germany in 1938 as a pesticide. It is a clear, colorless and tasteless liquid that can evaporate into a vapor. Sarin was used in two terrorist attacks in Japan in 1994 and 1995. Exposure can occur through skin and eye contact or inhalation and can be found in contaminated water or food. Symptoms may appear in just a few seconds. In other words, in the same time it takes you to subscribe and hit the like button, and they vary depending on the dose received. They can range from runny nose to respiratory failure and death. Recovery is possible with treatment, but the best thing to do is avoid exposure, obviously. One to 10 milliliters of sarin on the skin can be lethal. Cyanide. Cyanide is a rapidly acting, potentially deadly chemical that can exist in various forms, such as hydrogen cyanide, cyanogen chloride as a colorless gas, sodium cyanide or potassium cyanide as a crystal form. It can have a bitter almond smell, but not always. It is found in natural substances, in some foods and plants, cigarette smoke, and even in paper, textiles and plastics. Cyanide, known as Zyklon B, was used as a genocidal agent in World War II by the Germans. Exposure can occur through breathing air, drinking water, eating food, or touching soil that contains cyanide. It prevents cells from using oxygen and can lead to death if 100 to 200 milligrams are ingested. Long-term effects can include heart, brain, and nerve damage. Botulinum toxin. This toxin is produced by certain types of bacteria and it causes the disease botulism, which is a serious and deadly disease. The bacteria that produce this toxin are found naturally in many places, but it is rare for them to make people sick. It's also used in the cosmetic sector, believe it or not. You might know it as Botox. 
This toxin could be used in a biological attack. Some groups attempted to use the toxin as a weapon, but were unsuccessful. Symptoms of botulism typically start with paralysis of muscles in the face, which can spread to the rest of the body if untreated. People with botulism may require hospitalization, treatment with an antitoxin, and a ventilator to help them breathe. On average, just 180 nanograms of the toxin can be lethal if inhaled, and 54 nanograms if ingested. Bonus, Novichok. Novichok, a nerve agent created by the Soviet Union between the 1970s and the 1980s, is considered to be one of the most potent and deadly chemicals known to man, with some variants being eight times more potent than VX. It is designed to be undetectable by most conventional measures and is designed to defeat protective gear. The compounds are assumed to have a very fine powder form. When inhaled or absorbed through the skin, the agent affects muscles and nerves throughout the body and vastly overstimulates glands, causing death by suffocation. The symptoms of Novichok exposure include muscle twitching, convulsions, and respiratory distress. It is made up of two non-toxic compounds that are mixed together to become deadly, making Novichok safer to store and transport. In March 2018, a former Russian military officer, who became a double agent for the British intelligence agencies, Sergei Skripal, and his daughter Yulia Skripal were poisoned in Salisbury, England, with a Novichok nerve agent. They both survived after being in critical condition for several weeks. Nick Bailey, a police officer that attended the incident, also had to be taken into intensive care and was discharged later. If you like this video, you'll love this suggestion. Click and go watch, like, subscribe, and goodbye.